Hey guys, it's from DanFamagination.com and it's time for another studio update. Yes, we haven't had one in quite a while, so I'm back, I'm here, and I'm updating the studio and I'm updating you and showing you awesome miniatures, what we're working on, what we're doing, my messy hairstyle and uh, all that stuff. So, without further ado, over here, this man, he is working on the photography and everything, as always. We have some, what was that, uh, Blackstone Fortress. Staho is working on the emails. <coughs> Thomas is doing the same. We're getting them more and more. Uh, oh, I have a cool announcement to make. Uh, Geek and Sundry, uh, the team that is playing Vampire Masquerade, uh, we did a diorama for them with cooperation with Hero Forge and they uh, gave us a shout out and they are really pleased with the diorama. You can see the diorama in the link below and the uh, link to the article as well. So we are pretty pumped and happy because there's some like a little bit of fame going on. <laughs> so we're really happy. Uh, thank you to Hero Forge for cooperating with us. Uh, we love to work on your miniatures and to work with you. You are an awesome team. Keep it up guys. Okay, let's go further. Let's check out what is happening in the studio. Hello guys! Hi! Hi Gosha! Hi! What are you working on? Uh, Ultramarines. Ultramarines. Level 2, 3 and 4. Oh, awesome. Level 4 is probably for the hero, oh, yes? It's more. Oh, there's more. Very nice, really nice. Oh, we have a new model. Cool. Hi Maciej. Hello. You're working on... Dirty seals. <laughs> Dirty sails, yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm gonna show you in a moment a big diorama that we're doing for Whiskits. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be awesome. Hello, Mala. Hello. You're working on Ultramarines as well. Yes, as, as Gosha. As Gosha. The same project? Yes. Okay. Hey, you. You're working on? Guess. Hmm. I have blue. And I have ultramarines. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's ultramarine heavy today in the studio. Hmm. What is Nisa working on? Nisa working on a kill team. A kill team. A kill team. Mm -hmm. Some custom kill team with some yes. lion heads. Yes. Some fancy stuff. Fancy stuff in the backpacks. Mm -hmm. Really cool. Oh, really cool. Thank you. Agnieszka is missing. It's her day off probably, but she finished this model. Very cool color scheme. Some cool free handwork over here. Over here, Anya. Hey, Anya. Hey, yo. You're working on? Ariman and Maragal. Maragal Dreadnought, the big guy. Yeah, level three. Nice. Paulina is not here, but she's working on this conversion. Premiere's guy with a cape. We sculpted the cape. Kasha did this. Very cool. We have some imperial knights over here as well. Cool. Over here, Natalia. Hello, Natalia. Hello. Oh, Natalia has something special over here. This is a conversion or a 3D print of Tech Marine Grievu no Tech Marine Tech Priest uh, or or the other Tech guy for Mechanicus with the Grievous theme from Star Wars. So pretty cool, really awesome paint job by Natalia. Thank you, Natalia. Hello, Anya. Hi. So you're still working on the big yeah? You have the big Vostroyan army. Yes, and the. Yeah, and some, what are those called? Tyrox. Tyrox, yeah. Really original color scheme. Let's take a look at the army because it's almost finished. And it is quite huge. This is going to be like a really epic big army. Those are the bases. As you can see, there is like a ton of models for this army. Ton. It's 
really huge. Oh, over here we have almost finished a big set of our Titanicus on really high levels. So, yeah, jaw dropping stuff. Awesome. Over here, a secret project, so don't tell anyone. The Kraken Diorama from the Fallen Star set from WizKids, from Dungeons and Dragons. So we are slowly building up the waters. Kraken painted really beautifully. He is attacking the ship. There is a barrel already in the water. There's gonna be waves and stuff added. A lot of cool characters gonna be finding this. So this is gonna be epic. This is gonna be really epic. This crack is so amazing. We did the deck with the uh, real wood. So it looks really nice. Can't wait to see it finished. Hello guys. Hello. Hello. Hello Sandra, what are you working on? I'm working on Necrons. Um, Necrons, I, Ghost Ark. Yes, I think it's part of Ark, but mm -hmm. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> the, the Doomsday Ark, yeah, mm -hmm. because this is the other way around. And here is the big gun. We also have some four draw stuff, small pylons, and the big pylon. Hello Maya. Hi. So Maya is working on the big thing. Is it easy to paint? Mm, so yes. Such Very a big easy. model. <laughs> cool. It's really good quality. I don't know uh, how the assembly went, but it looks really nice right now. Hello, Monica. Hello. You're also working on Necrons. Yes, I do. <laughs> yes, a lot of Necrons. And I've got very small, tiny, cute <laughs> <laughs> little robots. Little robots. Very nice. Schwarzenegger. Schwarzenegger. Really cool. This is a big Necron army with the. A classic color scheme. Over here, Vortech. Hey, Vortech. Hello. You're working on something special. Uh, as always. <laughs> uh, yes, I have a white custodes. Very nice. With uh, green glowing swords and blades and other things. And other another project project is Celestine. Nice. This is a level six. Level six. Non metallic metal. Non metallic metal armor. Perfect. Really cool. And the guy there are more of the guys over here. They are based on our uh, Imperial City bases, I believe. Yes. There's a really cool color scheme to them. Very nice. The Custodes guys have some conversions, yes? Yes. They have uh, <coughs> hoods. hoods. Yeah, we sculpted hoods on them. Oh. Really nice. Looking really cool. Original. Thank you for your tech. Over here, Natalia. Hi. Natalia. Hi. You're working on? Uh, Imperial Knight. Imperial Knight. This one has a theme of like a Greek god, this is Poseidon, probably. Yeah. yeah? So, quite original. Over here, Agnieszka, hey. Hi. You're also working on an Imperial Knight. Yes, hey. it's Hera. It's Hera. This is Hera, okay. You worked on Ares previously. Uh, is it finished or? It's finished. It's finished. And where is it? Uh. There? Oh, over here. Here's Ares. Whoa, really cool freehand. I can't wait to see this project finished. Whoa, this is like comic book style. Freehand, really nice, really nice. This is the first time I see it, so awesome. Uh, over here, more of the Imperial Knights for the Greek gods. It's gonna be something. Here's a Grey Knight army, painted up. Over here the Whiskey's uh, characters for the ship. This is gonna be the crew, it's the captain. 
Hey Andrzej. Hello. You're working on assembling um, sisters. Conversion app actually. Conversion. It's gonna be a repressor conversion. And it's gonna be a kind of cathedral, a chapel. Oh, cool. Okay. Yes. Cool. It, those are the first steps, so it doesn't look so amazing now, but it will be. Let's stay tuned. We'll... And over here, some cool bases. What, what is this? Uh, it's for Magnus. For Magnus? Yes. Nice. And the goat heads from the Sangors, yes? Yeah, I think so. Cool, cool. Here, Agnieszka, what are you working on? Um, Astropads. Astropads. Very nice. Those are on level, level three. three. Level three, but still looking really nice, really cool. Hello, Lina. Hi. You're working on another god. Yes, uh, this is Hades. Hades, oh. Yes. <laughs> That's nice, really cool effects of the Thanks. lava fiery stuff going on. Really cool, really cool. Mm -hmm. uh, all those barrel lights have subtle conversions to them, so we're gonna be able to see it when they're finished and glued together. Can't wait to see it. Okay, thanks guys. This concludes our studio update. Thank you for watching. Be sure to leave a comment. Uh, tell me if you wanted to see something else. If you didn't want to see uh, any particular person. I'm kidding. Don't tell me that. Uh, and uh, click the bell next to the subscri subscribe button to get notified. That way your phone will ring every time we post another video. And you want that. Thank you. Bye bye. Stay tuned. Really good stuff. Uh, the paint, also, the paint quality is really good. Uh, the paint doesn't clog in an airbrush, so using it for big surfaces with an airbrush is also a really good idea. Uh, what can